guys, welcome back to the challenge. Your host with the most, Tomboy Double, and currently watching Tomboy TV. Welcome back. And today, we are headed back to the city of Soho. Oh, not the city of Soho, but the city of New York. And we're going to be headed to Soho. We're going to be linking up with a uh, shout out to the at Harlem reseller. And today, we got a very special video. Uh, so my homie actually managed, because I'm from Jersey, he's from uh, Harlem, and he was able to get the uh, Nike Atmos collab. Now, this Nike collab is very, very limited. Uh, Atmos actually announced it on their Instagram. I'll show you once we get to the city, like the actual uh, shit they posted about it and everything. But what happened is they said wristbands were coming out. Only 200, I think, were available. Uh, he got number 47, so he's golden. And they also got a jacket, some pants, a hat, and the shoes. Now, there are four items releasing for these Atmos collabs, and I don't think they're available anywhere else besides very few sites and at most japan i know has them uh on the via the app and then other smaller sites but like it's not very widely released like not only things releasing on sneakers uh but that actually reminds me the supreme ones are so today we're gonna do a little sneaker review in the city with them it might get a little bit windy because it's the city and it's about to be hella windy out there it's about to be like 45 degrees so i'm about to get the canada goose on shout out peep game you know what i'm saying if you guys haven't seen the new unboxing video hopefully it's posted by now but we do got that peep game drippy long sleeve coming down you guys can see the little little drip drip so i hope you guys enjoy this video i'm gonna catch you guys in there we're probably gonna drive up there and then also check out my video which was probably posted yesterday by now hopefully it was of what's in store at supreme what's still in stock because you know supreme saturdays are always the move so catch you guys in the city i just found all of supreme ss19 yo look at all these bricks look at all these bricks yeah, so we are officially on Mercer. This is part two of the New York City vlog. Uh, part one actually saw me attempt to rip down this Action Bronson poster. You know, I'm a huge fan of Action Bronson, man, and this fucking shows and shit. The poster was hilarious. I took a picture of it before I ripped it. It came down like half off, but you know, we'll work with it, it's whatever. Uh, but right now I'm headed to Palace, then Mercer, Soul Stage Grand opening, and then there's a bait drop. So there's like four different shit going down today. Then I got the Supreme video. So it's gonna be very good content today. We're gonna look up with the homie too, cause he got one out of 200 pairs of those uh, the Nike Atmoses. So that's gonna be mad interesting to see. But first I'm headed to Palace, cause hopefully they got something minor in there, like the t-shirt, the safe t-shirt. She would be elite. Ladies and gentlemen, oh my God, yo, what the fuck? Yo, yo, yo. How is the sticker there? Yo, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hope you guys can hear me. The sticker came out of fucking nowhere. This shit was not here last time. That's crazy, yo. That's actually wild. It was not here, yo. They took it down. Oh, but look, they cut it up. Damn. Damn. Supreme, Supreme. Fucking fire. Holy shit. These are the Pro Cells Air Force Ones. Bro, these are so tough. Holy shit. That Travis Scott AF1 material, and then we got the matching jumpsuits. Yo, that's crazy. Watch this, watch this. Boof. That shit crazy, 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 bro. And we got these sitting over here. And then we got these, the toddler size. I need, I need the preschool size, though. Six and a half hours later. Damn, so they had the Mars Yard Air Max 90s, and of course, no big sizes. They had toddlers. Damn, my hair is on some crazy shit today. Whoa, uh, but they did have the Mars Yard sitting over there. Uh, they had the Pro Cell Air Force Ones. Dude, I'm honestly thinking about pulling the trigger on them in my size for the personal because the material's made out of Travis Scott material and I feel like a custom on that shit would go perfect. So I don't know yet, but I'm about to head to Palace right now and see what they got. Hopefully make just a little bit of money. Nike checks over stripes, bro. Bro, and then we got anti-social social and Astro World. <sighs> Damn. Those would, those would have been a nice set of posters. So, unfortunately, I couldn't film inside a palace. Like, even though I do it with my phone a little bit, it was just mad awkward because I was really the only person in there. And I was like, ah, I don't really want to do this because everyone's staring at me. But I did actually come out with a purchase, you can see. And he, the homie in there actually, not really the homie, I don't really consider him homie. But the, the per worker in there actually hooked it up with a pair of something else in there for free. So, you know, that shit was lit. But I did get two purchases instead of one. I normally always get one item from there. I ended up getting two. Actually, an accessory. I never really cop accessories from Palace because they don't ever be doing well. But this one was actually a fire-ass accessory and a t-shirt. So, I'm going to unbox it when I get home. But they had a lot of stuff sitting from the drop. If you guys know the safeties, they had two colorways sitting of those, the gray and the blue. Oh, they had all the wallets and everything sitting. Ooh, what's this? Free item? Free item? Bogies. Bogues for free. You know what I'm saying? Don't be smoking out here, though. For real. So right now I'm about to head to Supreme, which is part of the other video, and then we'll be linking up the rest of the crew.
All right, guys, not sure if you can hear me that well or if you can see me that well. My hair is probably a mess right now. Uh, but right now, we're currently headed to round two because they put some steals. I can't really show you because this bag is weighing a fucking ton. And I can't really rip with my phone out at the moment. But, um, yeah, so we headed to round two because they got some CDG Supreme long sleeve for, like, 125 size XL. Uh, and then we're going to check it out. They got a bow going. The Atmos collab fucking Nike release has actually got shut down till 3 p.m. So everyone's still at that loop. So I might pop out, it's uh, on the 125th, so I'll see. Uh, but right now I'm probably gonna stay in Soho and see what I can get. The Grail, bro. The Grail. Yeah. Not too bad. Damn, bro, what the fuck? Yo. Yeah, -ho. Welp. OG Luke Mook shut my shit down completely. Um, so I did bring the jersey. Damn, my hair is fucking wild today. Uh, he shot down the jersey and he shot down the shoes. He was like, we're not interested in either of them. So I was like, I bet. So I uh, took my desperation to the dollar pizza store and I ate up. You know, I had to, I had to like empty out the hole, fill in the hole in my heart because uh, he just dubbed me. But it's whatever, bro. It's another day. Uh, they're still at Atmos. I'll put in the clip somewhere around now about how it was like shut down. <laughs> What's mad funny is that one of the employees put on like Air Max the 90s or the Air Max 90s with the leopard print on in front of the window that are worth like yellow bread. And people went just crazy in them. Uh, but yeah, they're waiting over there. I might pull up. I'm going to go to Bape right now. And after Bape, this bag is getting heavy as fuck. So I don't know what I'm going to do. We are officially in Origins and we finally linked up with the homie at uh, Harlem Reseller. You know what I'm saying? He just came back from the loop. These are it, finally. The Nike Atmos. Nobody had, barely anybody has them since they only released at Nike. Yo, look at these. So the detailing on this is absolutely crazy. We got all the colors the big air bubble for Air Max Day, the laces, the red swoosh. Damn. Max on the front. The other pair. The, the sole of them. Damn. And these are our size. Hold up, hold up. What size? They don't even got a size tag on them. Um, size, no, 10 and a half. 10 and a half. Yo, what are your thoughts? Uh oh. What are your it, was thoughts a on the item? it was a late release. Harlem got shut down six times. You know the vibes. But it's a $200 on top item. My son, Jalen over here, cook, you know what I mean? Hit him with the hoodie. Nah, that's a good Yeah. It's a good touch, item. Yo, touch. So basically, yo, what would you say these are flipping for right now? I sold these for, what, 150 over? 150 <laughs> over, and what was the retail, 200? 175. 175 retail, 200 over. Easy. That's easy money, and you touch seven pairs. I'm a, Once I get to the crib, I'm gonna show you guys the image he sent me. He touched seven pairs. Yeah, that was four pairs on that image, and that's so he yeah. actually stole. Yeah, he, yeah, he got loopy, and then they also come with these stickers. Lim limited, limited stickers. L limited at most stickers, bro. They're mad funny, but once again, these shoes, as I say, crazy detail, and the whole store inside, I'll put more videos at the end, that he, uh, Harlem Reseller, yo, on Instagram, check him out, at Harlem Reseller. Uh, he actually got all the videos from the inside. They like remodeled the whole entire store to look like this, like the tiling of the entire store, all different colors. You can see this is a loud ass shoe, but they're going for bread. And then they also released the hat and the jacket and track jacket, track pants and the hat. Oh, he touched some of the hats, but the rest of the items were pretty much bricks. But yo, even the box is coming with this detail. Cra crazy. Item. Oh yeah, let's check out the inside of the box real quick. Damn. And the paper. You know, I love the paper. Yo. Damn. That print all over. The box is a nice, nice quality box, nice and sturdy. You know what I'm saying? Damn. So that that loop actually, they gave our wristbands at 12 a.m. Then they shut it down, right? Yeah, it was 6 p.m. yesterday. 6 p.m. yesterday. They gave out 200 wristbands. 200 wristbands. 180 pairs. 180 pairs, bro. Why are they giving out extra bands? As if somebody is not gonna show up. But these are a crazy ass shoe. Would I rock them though? Most. Most uh, likely, I don't know. No, it's too much. Too much? I can't rock with that. It's too much. much. 
too it is too much i don't know like yeah, the full yeah. fit would kind of look kind nah, of but you know what i like about amos they changed it up they used a model that's not popular no more and they that's put it in a collab that's, that's what i love about the shoe it's yeah it's unique it is very unique and that's why they sell them for the high yeah of course because you, you don't see that you don't see an mh2 released by nike you see it with amos though that's there the difference. That's why it's an item. Hey, Max, man, it's going to be a lit month. A.M. month in the city. Loopy, And it comes with the two laces. The neon green and the purples. So you guys saw this pair of sneakers. They're crazy. Um, That's it for today. I mean, we're going to head back to the crib. What's up? 200. Oh, these are special. This is a special box, too. I forgot about that. It's a special box. It's not coming with every regular pair. Only Atmos exclusive, I'm pretty sure. Stickers were Atmos exclusive. Box was Atmos exclusive. Shoes might be releasing somewhere else, like a few other locations, tier zero, tier one accounts, but that's about it. So, hope you guys enjoy it. I'm gonna catch you guys back at the crew. Pair to two pairs. One pair to two pairs. Damn. Smaller size, but you know, small sizes will do. Oh, it's okay. Oh. Oh. Barcode! Hi, Barcode! Yo, Must the new Nike it. technology. I must never cop a fake. Bro, that's never. crazy. You scan that you shit. scan that, look, a yeah, whole new fine. size tag. And everything, and it tells you exactly where it was made and shit like that. I must Damn. never. Damn, I wonder. Me. Yo, I want to scan that. Does it? You think it tells you where you bought it? Yeah, yo, you better do it now. Yeah. No, yeah. just no way. You do it with this, with this, because you're, oh, yeah. you're kind of close. Let's see if it'll work. No chance. Moment of truth. Moment of truth. Na 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 Up. Uh, oh, oh shit! Oh, oh shit! Oh, oh shit! Oh, oh! If it doesn't direct you to Nike, it's a fake. No fucking way. What? That's oh. fire. Oh, it goes to sneakers. That's actually oh, fire. Wait, That's actually fire. What? Fuck with that. Hold on, Easiest way to legit check. Yo, let me see, your, let me see the barcode let's real quick. Let's check. Let's check. Let me see the barcode. I mean, it directed it to Nike. Yeah. Yes, once once I mean, it directs you, I guess, I guess it probably once it directs you to Nike or Gucci, I guess. Yeah. That's, That's lit though. Shoe. That's the item. I might go get some cookies. That's lit. That's lit. That's, That's lit. Legit shoe. Eat up. Eat up. And we are finally back to this beautiful New Jersey home, and it is official. I did cop way too much shit, and you know, I'm just gonna say, help me out. All that shit can be available for sale at Tommy's Taylor, just a little heads up. But we do got a lot of vape, a lot of Adidas. Not really Adidas, what am I saying? Why, why, why am I thinking Adidas right now? But welcome back, by the way. Oh, I forgot to talk about, like, you know, a little intro. So we did go to, as you guys saw, we did get the little Nike Atmos review. Uh, not sure I'm going to edit this whole thing. That might be a separate video. This might be a separate video. But most likely now, this will probably just be one giant video. Uh, that, that shoe was absolutely crazy. I mean, it was wild. But, you know, we did do a little bit of vlogging in there. We did do a lot of uh, in-store stuff. So I did go to Bait pa No, yeah, whoa. Yeah, Bait Palace. Uh, Supreme, that was a separate video. Check out yesterday's video if you guys do want to see that. But I was walking around with this big ass bag full of stuff. Uh, but I did bring some stuff to round two, which ended up being a massive L because they actually ended up saying, Oh, we're not interested in any of it. So I was like, all right, all right, I mean, I guess you you do you, it's your business. I can't tell you nothing how to run it or what to buy. But this this little item from, well, actually two items from Palace, actually three if you really do think about it, uh, from Palace was $135.10, $6, almost $7 to the government. You're very welcome. Uh, but we do got two pieces. So first off, I do want to show off this. They did have the safety still sent. So they had the blue and the gray safety still sent. Now this is an XL. Definitely going to be taking a picture of this one at Thomas Verco. I am actually ecstatic that they had this. This is one of the best t-shirts that are coming out from Palace this season. We do got that front. And if you guys could probably see from the intro of this video, this I actually found the billboard in New York City. Then on the back, that big ass graphic. So you can see Palace safe right over here on the back. Then you got the little dude coming into the Palace window right there. So this vlog was actually jam-packed with a lot of pickups, a lot of good uh Content, at least I think so. So hope you guys enjoyed it. Quality on this is actually amazing. XL. Uh, not sure how it's gonna fit. I'm not really gonna try it on right now because I do have to go out to dinner real quick. But Fire ST, one of my favorite ones from the season. Quality on the printing is pretty decent. I do want to check if it's like printed on the back. Oh, it might. That's what. Yeah, you might have to wear a shirt underneath this or like a little uh, wife beater. You know what I'm saying? Under it because it could stick if it does get a little too hot. But yo, I, I was actually I wasn't that surprised that they were still not really sitting, but that the two colors are available. I was kind of hoping the night before I was like, yo, I hope they got it safety so still there, still available for a purchase, especially in a good size because sometimes you do get some wax sizes. But the second item, as I said in the video, an accessory. I normally don't ever copy accessories from Palace. But right here, you can see the $80 leather card holder. Not sure if I'm going to... I mean, I might just have to take this out. I might. I'll show you guys what it looks like in hand. Uh, let's, oh, yeah. It's nice and easy. Nice little, little packaging. I mean, they did have the wallet still sitting in the card holder. 
um, a few other stuff as well. I mean, you some people get mad at me for saying sitting when they really were sitting. Like you guys, I mean, I love Palace. Like Palace is a most one of the most fire brands out there. Uh, I I still do think. I mean, they are getting slept. I'm not slept on, but a lot of people don't fuck with them as much as they used to. I still do though for sure. I I think they're still com competitive with Pal I mean, with Supreme. Supreme does get more hype, of course, because it is Supreme. But this is the Palace card holder. Nice little unboxing right here. Damn, I actually never really owned a card holder before, especially not a nice one like this. But you do got Palace on the front right there. A nice gold lettering, different little shades coming up. The quality, though, looks very decent. So we do got Palace London on the back as well. Uh, card holders are pretty hyped. I mean, go mainly because they got different colors on the inside. Yellow on the inside, gray on the outside. Dude... I probably should. I mean, I already sold this one on my page at Tommy's Taylor. So if you guys haven't checked it out, make sure to check it out. But the lettering on this one, nice metal pieces. On the back, it's kind of embossed into the back of it. $80. Oh, uh, they're not going for that much. I'm pretty sure they're going for like $130, $120. But you know, money is money. Lunch money is lunch money. Um, Great piece. I mean, to put your cards in and everything. What I caught myself, I could use a card holder. I mean, actually, I probably should. Because the thing that I have on the back of this phone, it just like shattered. It's broken. It's absolutely broken because I've just broken it so many times. Now I'm thinking I probably should have kept this for myself, but you know, maybe not. We'll see. Now we go on to the Adidas loop. I'm not Adidas. I don't know why I keep having Adidas stuck in my head, but the Bape loop. So this is not in the Bape bag because I took it all out. But just know, your boy had to go crazy at the Bape store. I literally went, I'm an ape. Ape at the Bape store. So you can see I did not caught one, but two, but three, but four ducks from this Bape collab. They're like, yeah, sure, take them in, you fucking want. I don't really care. I was like, all right, man. I got, I was like, at first I wanted two, as you guys saw. Then I went back later and got another two. They're actually flipping for about $70. So I did sell two of them. The other two, I mean, one, I'm probably going to put up over here. Little Bape guy. I mean, it does have, it's not really that crazy either. I'm surprised that there are actually people want these that badly. Uh, but we do got little on the wings. It's literally just a rubber duck. People be, be paying like $70 for this rubber duck. I'm like, wow, you guys really need this rubber duck. I mean, hey, yo, I'm there. If you guys need it, I got it. You know what I'm saying? But this is the FC Real Bristol collaboration. They actually had a, did have some jerseys in there as well. Nothing really sold out. Nothing worth it that much either. But I mean, I think this was the most profitable item from the actual bait drop. So as I said, they're all the same. They're all identical. This one doesn't actually have the tag on it. Let me see this real quick. They actually all do, except this one, uh, that one over there. But you can see this price is F, black size, color SS19. Little babe tag right there. This is what they put on the plastic. It is it retail on this one was like thirty dollars plus tax made it like thirty four dollars. So thirty four dollars times four. 120 132 something like that you guys can do the math but you know i i kind of didn't expect them to be doing this so i mean i looked at the drop the night beforehand i was like oh it's babe i mean there might be some stuff worth it to cop but not really but hey it was pretty interesting to see people trying to go for this duck i mean i think that's about it actually there's oh wait what am i saying the other babe the palace you know i'm as you can tell i'm a mix but the free gift. I mean, I'm pretty sure they gave away these matches before. I just never got them. But now, I guess they were able to throw them in. They never done it a week before. I thought they did this a while ago, like the free matches. They did throw in the free sticker, but the matches are even better, man. I love these matches. More like some London shit they use. A uh, New York. Oh, actually, this is New York. Ex New York exclusive matches. That is fire. And then we got Palace on the front little clip right there. Then on the back, I think you have Palace brand new over there. I'm definitely not going to be using these though. Uh, I'm probably going to put them up. Right, a nice little color, different than red all the time. Hopefully that goes up there, but I'll fix that later. So next up though, I do want to show you something that I got for free actually, entirely free off this off the walls of New York. If you guys don't know, I'm actually a big poster whore. I love to put shit up in my room. And as you guys saw, probably, actually you guys probably didn't see in this video, it was actually in the Supreme video from yesterday. I did rip this down. I mean, I did have to do some cosmetic, some cosmetic fixing to the uh, beautiful face of Action Bronson. Of uh, stone beyond belief. I just think it's a fire ass when it has nice bright color something to put into the room Because everything is basically the same color same shade. So it's like, you know, this will look perfect in the room I might put it over there or I might put it over there with the regular the rest of the blessed posters I know room tour is coming soon. Don't worry that shit's coming as soon as possible I mean my room just on this side of the wall is nothing crazy on this side It's pretty okay well, on that side. It's nothing crazy So I do want to put up the skate decks that I have I'm still debating how I want to do it because I'm moving out soon, so we're just gonna see over the time. But you know, this one's sick, Action Bronson. I did, I did have to put some paper on the back. Definitely going up sometime soon. So hope you guys enjoyed this one. Abrupt ending, but actually my camera cut off. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Of course, for that free Discord, all you gotta do is send me a screenshot. You subscribe to hype underscore NJ. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure you stay tuned for tomorrow's retail resale estimations. This is a video very up to date. I'm literally editing and uploading right now. I'm gonna take some pictures outside because it's a beautiful ass day out here in the Jersey weather. So hope you guys enjoyed. Peace.